I, I am going to add that um, I could tell a difference right away with my bite after the treatment. It yeah. feels a lot better. And like I went, you have a good home? Yeah. So where are you from? I'm from Texas. And what brought you here? Um, I've been having jaw pain for, gosh, at least 20 years, if not more. Yeah. Um, just right through here, I get, it hurts all the time. Not extremely bad, but sometimes it hurts so bad it just feels like it's knotting up mm -hmm. and just very painful. Is it mostly in like the cheeks or? It's mostly just right through here and sometimes it comes up through here also through the temples. And I'll get headaches, especially in the evening. It seems like I have the headaches more in the evenings and mm -hmm. it causes noise to bother me really bad. Neck is usually very stiff. It's hard to turn to look over my left shoulder. It's I mentioned it to a dentist. 15 years ago or so, and I got a night guard. Yeah. Never really helped. I still have the jaw pain all yeah. the time. Uh, I went and saw a chiropractor about my hand going numb, and he mentioned that TM, he could help the TMJ also, because I mentioned my jaw hurting. Huh. And that was four years ago, three years ago, and but it no didn't help. Resolution. No, it didn't help either. Yeah, so, so you've been through many splints, not just one? Well, or? three. Three? <laughs> I was about to get my fourth one made, right. What did you think of the screening? We screened you uh, yesterday morning. Right. What was your experience? What did you see? Did you understand what we were doing? I, yes, you were very good about explaining everything about what was going on. And it was very informative. It's just it's nothing I've ever seen before. The imaging. The imaging, yes. And the anatomy. Right. And the function. Right, how everything works together and mm -hmm. it's, it's amazing. Your joints weren't perfect, your hinges, your joints right. were not perfect, but and your right side in particular was a little bit more messed up than your left, right? Right, right. Because of the hinge being a little bit off, the TMJ, the cartilage, the disc being torn out, the hinge altered the way your teeth and your jaw moved and interacted, mm -hmm. right? right? So it wasn't just a tooth thing, right. this was a joint-based issue. And I think the cold sensitivity, I can't remember not having it, so I'm pretty sure. It's been there. It's been there a long time. Give me a zero to 10. It's probably about a two. Two-ish? Two-ish. It's not uncomfortable? Not like it was before, no. Yeah, did you no. notice a, a slow progression yesterday when we were doing I the did, yes. procedure? I did, yes. Yes, yeah. because at the beginning I, it hurt to even try to swish. But and now it's no big deal. I can swish, I can feel the cold, but it's not painful, painful. That's normal. And my I can feel my teeth touching where they didn't before. Yeah. And chewing is so much easier. Chewing yeah. food. Yeah. It was just, I didn't feel like I was working at it to eat. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Like I said, I didn't sleep with my mouth guard last night. I didn't wake up in pain. Yeah. Well, it's only yeah. been a day, too. Right, it's only been a day, but yeah. it's not like it was before. Yeah, so. this is profoundly different. Yes, oh yes. Awesome. It feels a lot better. What advice do you have for people? If you're having any kind of jaw pain, come see you. Come see Dr. Nick, because it does help. Um, I was very skeptical. I watched all these videos. Yeah. And I kept waiting for someone to say, oh, it's a fake, it doesn't work at all. Um, never saw one that said that and came here and... And it does work.